back up here, pop you, come back down here, grab you, okay. Alright, more gold. We're up to 62. But the run's almost through on this time. Oh, that'll help. 73. Okay. And there's more gold there that I just saw drop. Another one there. We'll grab you. We'll wipe you out. No chest. Give us crit. That would be huge. Nope. Yo, 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 everybody, what's going on? It is Lodi's here, back with another Nordic Ashes run. Hopefully, y'all have enjoyed the content. If so, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Every little bit counts. I do greatly appreciate it. It helps the channel out a lot. And hopefully, it brings some new peeps to the channel as well. Without further ado, let's jump right on into this. We're going to jump right on in. We played Amaranth in the last episode. If you didn't see it, make sure you guys go and check it out. We are going to jump in and play Hansi. Um... Yeah, I think we'll go Crimson Dagger again. And, yeah, we'll jump in on normal. Once again, it's going to be normal. It's probably going to be a breeze with Hansi. I'm not really too worried about it. Next one, we'll probably play, play um, the, um, I mean, shoot. Lucky Mushroom ring out the gates pretty good. Um, we'll, we'll probably end up running the, um, the pool the next time we run uh, Hansi. Or maybe we'll get lucky and we will run the pool on um, Chaos or Missing. We'll see. This is a really good item all around, though, for every single character. Um, it's just a phenomenal item, so I'll definitely take it any day of the week. But yeah, hopefully all have been enjoying the content um, as much as I have. Um, I know I speak about it almost every video. But uh, I just can't get enough of this game, um, even though it seems a little tedious at times. It's definitely a game that I uh, enjoy playing, uh, putting the time into, grinding. Um, I feel like it, even though it's like kind of the same stuff over and over, it doesn't. It feels like it doesn't really get all that boring. Um, or at least I haven't yet to experience that. Okay, we finally got the mushroom. Holy smokes, that took forever. Alright, let's run over here. You know, we got some points. Let's spend some points in uh, some of this stuff here. Um, let's see. Yeah, that works. Uh, I don't really care about duration. Um, that works. Projectiles and crit. Crit and damage. I want to mine more projectiles. Cooldown projectiles works. Projectiles crit works. Okay, that's fine. I definitely want as many projectiles as we can get, though. Squirt gun, I'll take. That's fine, too. Um, squirt gun actually feels really good as well. Like, it's like hard sniper, and it has like piercing and stuff on it. So I, I think I think um, squirt gun's really good, or water gun, whatever it may be. Feel, feels phenomenal. With the water piercing and whatnot. So we are um, officially less than 400 seedlings away of unlocking the relic swapper switcherooski whatever it may be called i don't remember it's relic something relic exchange stranger maybe I'm not sure but we're getting super close to that probably uh, one more run after this i would assume and uh we'll have it which will be pretty sweet pretty darn sweet so that'll be awesome um yeah, we're, we're just slowly chipping away at this. Um, I don't really think we're going to have, once again, too many issues with any of this. But, uh, yeah. Um, should be good. Should be good. Let's see here. Let's run over here, grab this, and then... Do we have... Okay, we do have one. So let's upgrade this, of course, from the depths. It's always a good one to have. Uh, I'll get you, and then projectiles and cooldown. Uh, that'll, that'll be fine. Even though usually I go for projectiles and damage, projectile cooldown will be perfectly fine with this one. Um, I'm not too worried about that. Uh, we'll pick you up. We'll head down here to the gold guy and see what see what the gold altar or shrine has for us. Ooh, increased movement speed. I'll definitely take that. I love me some movement speed. Movement speed always feels good. Unless we're doing like a standstill build, but there's nothing... There's not really a whole lot to do 
or standing still. Like, I, I just, I don't think there is really much to stand still for. Okay. Get that. We're already back up to 31, so that's good. I mean, it's it's effect prob and crit, so nothing too too crazy for um for shrine or uh, yeah for shrines. We did get an XP ring, which is huge. I'll definitely take the XP ring. That's massive for us. Okay. Ooh, and I actually the crit would be really good on Hansi. Because I wasn't paying attention, but we do have uh, two of the orbs that we need. We need five to cap out, and I believe that's like 75 uh, crit for that. So, definitely uh, more the merrier there. Okay, more gold. I really wish crates would show up on the map. That'd be huge. Or even seedlings before they drop, so we could pick up, uh, so we could just run into the seedling uh, things and pick as many of that up as we can. But um, they only show up on the ground after you destroy the plant, but since we have auto pickup, it automatically picks them up, so. Don't have to worry about that either. Ooh. Okay, sweet, we got that. There's another one here, we got that. We got four. Orbs, which is massive. Okay. Only 40 gold this run, unlike uh, the Amaranth run. If you have not seen that, make sure you guys go check out that run. That run was crazy. We hit max uh, 95 gold. Every single wave, we had capped out gold, which was insane. We haven't unlocked the uh, 250 gold yet, but we maxed out at 99 gold every single wave with Amaranth, and it was insane. Like we were able to buy so much stuff. Fortunately, I don't see that happening this run, but uh, you never know. Could definitely happen. Uh, I'll pick you up. I'll definitely pick you up. Um, what is this? 50%? Okay, well, we're not really above 100%. I mean, this might not be bad. Let's go area first. I might go this one. But maybe I'll stick with daggers this run. I'll stick with daggers this run. Let's see how this goes. What do we have for this guy? Okay, increased damage you deal to bosses or this one, which I, I love that one. Um, I might go with the bosses one, though, so we'll see. Even though I do really, really enjoy the um, the other one, I think we will stick with uh, the boss one this round. Um, not that it really matters, because we should shred the boss pretty dang quickly, especially after we get the next Ascension Crystal. So I'm not really worried about that. We are up to 62 gold, though, so we are slowly progressing towards that 99, but we definitely aren't going to get that uh, this run. Or not, not necessarily this run, but this wave. Um... I definitely am trying to get as many seedlings as possible because if we can get um, um oh that hit me but it didn't uh, oh and we smoked that guy okay let's see of course this and this uh, I'll get this, this, this. Uh, we'll level the crap out of this guy. Okay. Yep, we got that. We'll throw another point into you. Sweet. We have all that. I'll definitely take this guy. Um, damage I'll take. Um, area. I would love to try and get more crit. Uh, I'll take cooldown on that. I mean, these are both really good. I think I'm going to take both of these. I am going to run over here, grab this guy. Uh, we should be critting a lot, so I think I'm going to take that as well. Ooh. Ooh. 
Ooh, I'm gonna take this. Oh, and I might as well take this too, since we're gonna have to be poisoning stuff. Poisoning some peeps now, so I'll grab this. Oh, and gives us the poison and fire one too. Okay, sweet. That's actually pretty pretty gnarly, dude. Alright, sweet. So that should be really good. We should be really good on that. Um, there's no way... I don't think there's a way to make sure that we get... Uh, I'll take this and roll the dice. There's no way... The odds of us getting 400 seedlings, I feel like, are slim to none. I don't, I don't think that's going to happen. I honestly just don't think that's going to happen. So we'll see. We'll see. But we're gonna try. Because if we could get 400... If we could get 400 saplings, that would put us... So I think we're at 96.39 or something. So... 96.39, that would put us at, what, 331 we need? 331? I think we could definitely get that in um, the next run. This run, not so much. Like, I just don't think we're going to get it. This I don't think we're going to get 331 this run. Um next run we'll definitely hit the mark but this one it'll be i think we'll get like around 150 would be my guess is where we're gonna probably end up being around which is perfectly fine 150 is a okay because that gives us a quite a bit of uh seedlings even though we're not leveling things up until we hit axeldor so which we should have a good stack of leaves by then um, I don't think anything is going to be completing expert mode anytime soon to get a good chunk, but we should definitely be stacking up enough leaves from that on top of getting a good chunk of leaves from just collecting all the seedlings and stuff, so that'll be really good. Okay, we're going to grab you, because now we're also going to be doing burn damage as well, which is pretty sweet. Um, our crit, though, is only 64%. We get one more, I think it'll be up to like 70, no, 89, or no, 79, I think, because I believe it's 15%, um, which I don't think will be too bad. And then, of course, if we can get any more from Talkor, which we should be able to get some, which will be pretty huge, um, but we will just have to, we'll just have to see. We'll just have to see. Hopefully we will. I don't think we'll have a problem getting it, but um, yeah, we'll see. We shall see. Okay. And I'm seeing a good chunk of gold drop. Nothing too crazy, though. Um, run up here, grab you. Dash over here, grab this one. Right here. And then we'll run back down to that altar. Get the rest of those kills. Only need five, so we're good there. Um, where am I going? Probably up to the mine. Be my next uh, run, too. Yeah, eight. Okay, not bad. So there's at least two crates near the mine and a seed, two seedlings as well. Oh, three crates and a seedling. Okay. Three crates and two seedlings, I should say. Just farm these seedlings, man. Get more than enough. Ooh, is there a... There is not. Yeah, I wasn't sure if there was an XP one. I was like, if there is, like, we're totally going to start farming some XP, but... Um, I'm still skeptical on this yet because we're not over a hundred or er, we're not over a hundred percent for this guy So I may look into getting this but we'll hold off for now I'm just gonna upgrade it. I don't really care what I get on that one So I'm just gonna upgrade to upgrade it. Ooh, I'm gonna pop you Dash back up here pop you come back down here grab you okay all right, more gold. We're up to 62, but the run's almost through on this time. Oh, that'll help. 73. Okay. And there's more gold there that I just uh, dropped. Another one there. We'll grab you. We'll wipe you out. Another chest. Give us crit. That would be huge. No crit. Can I roll? Will this give me crit? No, I don't really have summons. 
Okay, I guess I'll take attack speed. That's a little bit of a bummer. Crit would have been huge there. Even though it would have been like 5%, that's that's still 5%. Like That still would have been massive. Because um, with that 5%, that would have still gave us that little bit of uh, push toward having 100. Or working towards having 100. Like 79 is still pretty dang good. And then if we can get this last um, orb, like that would put us up to like what? 90 like four I think or some somewhere in there So that'd still be super good and then on top of getting uh, this guy up here Which is another 25% on top of that. I mean 94 is huge Then we could get the 50 50 one where like every time we crit we do 50% more damage And if we don't crit we do 50% less damage with 94% crit we're critting Well 94% of the time, so we'll be critting pretty dang good there. We're up to 94 gold as well We you we're probably going to hit it here uh, after I pick up uh, this big chunk of Ruski down here. Too bad that we had some go to waste there, but hey, we were able to pick it up. And uh, all that. But there's a ton of potions on this map right now. A ton of potions. I would love to find my last orb, but I don't think I'm going to. Um, I'm not worried about this guy at all. See, this guy I'm never worried about. Um, yeah, they're dead. This guy is not a great boss, man. Like, we just shred the crap out of him. Grab you. Oh, we don't. We can't grab you. Um, burn damage, sure. Enemies won't be immune to anything, sure. Ooh, 5% crit, I'll take. So that actually would have been 3% crit, unfortunately. Uh, I'm not worried about dying, no. Poison, um, ooh, what is that? It's a... Charming Fungus. I don't think we've seen that before. Uh, let's roll Talkor. Oh my gosh, we have the Golden Milky as well. 50% increase to that. I'll take that as well. Holy cow, this is a wonderful flipping shop. Oh, it's only 2%. We're up to 76% crit. Not terrible. Um, no, no, no. Okay. Cool, um, you know what? Screw it. Yeah, let's not, because we do have the golden Noki. But, odds are we will cap out. So, I think I'm still going to take. I'm going to take this. Screw it, man. It's like. We capped out and we wasted some gold there, so I'm just going to take everything because then if we cap out, cool. If not, it's not the end of the world. Um, we do have to remember, though, like taking the golden Noki, we are playing with Takor, so if we spend gold, we're going to lose that damage. Um, but if we don't, we'll have 99% damage. Is this the grand additional dash? Okay, interesting. We do dash pretty far, so taking an additional dash might not be a bad, uh, bad idea. So we'll look into that. Give us crit, man. Um, I guess I'll take this crit on this. I mean, they gave us crit, but not the uh, crit I was looking for. Okay. I don't think I picked the effect problems one up once this run. Come down here, get this gold. Lots of gold there. Dash over here. Don't have quite enough yet, but if we run down to the mine, I'm sure we will. Two? Um, not quite. Oh, we got a piece right here. We'll grab you. And, oh, snap, there is one down there. Get to it, get to it, get to it, get to it. Heck yeah, we got to it. So we're sitting at 91% crit. That is pretty good. And we got a ring. Oh my gosh, we got an XP ring. Sweet, we didn't have to buy this one. So we're looking really good. Um, crap, we need 20. Oh, there's another XP ring up here. Oh, snap, dude. I'm gonna pop this one then. Pick this one up. Okay, we got 20 gold, but we also got 20 XP points. Ah, oh, you son of a biscuity bulldog. Oh, we didn't lose a. We didn't lose a um, thing, an, a shadow orb, which is huge. Uh, I'll take the additional dash. Why not? I need them. I needed to work towards that one achievement of dashing a thousand times. Which I should be pretty dang close. 
feel like. I've been dashing quite a bit out in these runs. Okay. I mean, we got 26 points. Let's spend them. I think I'm going to spend it on this one. Like, we should be critting almost every time. Um, I'm going to max out the ultimate as well. Um, cooldown summons is perfectly fine. Um, and I'll max this out, or I'll work towards maxing that out, and then we can max out the squirt gun as well. Um, once we max out the squirt gun, we won't have points for anything else, so it's not going to really matter. So, that's okay. I might end up actually taking a gold ring instead if that drops. Because right now gold is more valuable than XP to me. Since we have just about everything maxed out. I mean, I'm still going to take the XP ring just in case. But, like I said, we don't necessarily need it. This time we're critting just about every single time. I mean, with 91%, I think we're critting almost all the time anyways. But, I'm not seeing a whole lot of gold drop. Which is a little bit of a bummer. Seeing more ex more uh, health pots more than anything. There we go. I may not even buy anything from Talkor to be completely honest with you. Oh, now the gold is pouring out. Right there's twenty gold. Come back over here. There's some um, another seedling. Okay, oh, there's another another one piece of gold. I'll take you, yoink. I'll take you, yoink. Easy piece of lemon squeeze it, baby. Slowly working our way up there. There's another one. Alright. Another two. Sweet. Alright. Yeah, we're looking... Really, really good. Alright. Okay. Yeah, I'm not, uh, I'm not seeing any issues with this one. Sindri should be a walk in the park, as always. Um, we have maxed out orbs. Um, oh, I should have went to crit instead. I didn't even get effect probs, so not going to really matter. We do have 25 points, so I'm going to dump you into here. Probably should be able to knock all of them into this. Okay, cool. Um, I'll get you. That's 68 um, there's no crit here. I mean, bounces could be insane. I'm going to take that just in case. I don't know why I just re-rolled projectile speed. Eh, I don't care about any of that. We got 45. Let's run into this and see how quickly we can beat him. We probably won't beat him as quickly as we did with Amaranth. Amaranth was less than a second. Like, Amaranth was absolutely freaking insane. Okay, he's dead. Um, but we killed Amaranth a lot quicker. 245. That's not bad. And we got uh, the rogue skin. Cool. Cool. Yeah, hopefully y'all enjoyed this uh, episode. Um, there's not much we can change with Hansi, unfortunately. But, yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy. And, yeah, the Charming Fungus was a new one. Um, if so, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. I'd greatly appreciate it. If, also, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. And don't forget to subscribe. Uh, every little bit helps, and I do greatly appreciate it. You guys can also tap that bell notification to get notified when a new video goes live, as I do upload every single day. Um, so make sure you guys tap that, as uh, times may change. But so you guys don't miss the video, just uh, ding that notification bell on. Uh, once again, this has been Nordic Ashes. And in the next episode, we should get enough to get the Relic Exchanger. We only need, a, looks like, 109. So that should be fairly easy to get. And uh, we'll be playing Missing. So, yeah, make sure you guys tune in. And once again, thank you guys all for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.